What is going on my fly guys? Welcome as we turn back with another video and today we are returning for it. Are you seasonal round four? And um so I'm we're challenging Paleo. So let's go right on into it. Alright, so going to my computer is being a little slow, but we're gonna start with try hard for RU because that's our best team so far. All right, I'll pause until we are in the battle, and we are here. All right, so uh, we are probably going to see the lead, um, the lead Steelix, but Hello. shut up. All right, Hello. or all right, so um, yeah. Let's see who really beats this team if my computer wants to stay alive. All right, you know I'm just gonna. Hold up, just, let me just, gotta get out of the chat room for a sec. Alright, so maybe, Check outside. Brooklyn Blazing Kids are better! Alright, that should stop the lag a little bit, but alright, so, stop! Brooklyn Blazing Kids are better! Ah! Alright, so we're just gonna lead Steelix, I mean. How Brooklyn Blazing Kids no. are better! Stop, chill. Brooklyn Blazekids are better. Do you know what this is? Are you seasonal? Brooklyn Blazekids. Ow! Next Alright, we're just gonna go for an EQ. No. Alright, so uh, we're gonna go switch immediately into Eel. If he toxics, he toxics. It doesn't matter that much, but. Alright, so um, I'm going to go for a flame. Throw predicting this Steelix to come out. Flygon actually comes in, and I'm gonna go for a Giga Drain. Because I could live whatever he wants. If he wants to U turn, he's gonna U turn, and someone's about to get Giga Drain. So, you know, it's a win win. Alright, so he actually goes into Verizion, so that kind of sucks. And I'm just gonna Volt Switch on his Swords Dance and go immediately. Alright, let's see. I'm trying to think. If we go to. He outspeeds Fly Guy Sitchu, but he might. If he. Have, well, hmm. Alright, so here's the plan. I'm gonna go in the Fly Guy Sigi and immediately switch into Ship Face on the Hound Doom switching. Cause, you know. As he actually goes for a Stone Edge and he has the Stone Edge. Alright. So I'm gonna go right for a Drain Punch right now. I mean, it's only switching to Ship Face is really wheezing. And if you will, it was. I mean, he gives us guts and we could just go for a knockoff. A lot of teams aren't prepared for Girder. I like that a lot. So, yeah. No one really wants coming on Drain Punch, except the Weezing! As he goes into the Weezing. Okay, and he has Black Sludge. So, I'm gonna go Calcus out. So, we're gonna have Girder bulk up against Weezing. Are you physically defensive? And we're gonna have plus one with Burn. Knockoff does. Nice. So I'm gonna go for a bulk up right here. As he, all right. I'm just gonna go. I'm going for game right now. I'm going for game. He does not have the Zen headbutt, so he can't really touch shift face at all after it sets up, unless it has the the sacred sword. But usually they don't carry sacred sword. Alright, so I'm just going to continually set up bulk ups on this Weezing. Uh, I'll be right Alright, so... What is up everybody? I'm Griff from the Brooklyn Blaze Games, and where you are, you turning back with another video. Alright, so, um, I'm going to go for a Drain Punch here just to get some health back. I mean, it's not a lot, but... This, how about we just go to healthy and plus two? What? How much? What? Knockoff actually does some good damage. What about at plus three? Nah, we're not doing that much. But I'm going for a drain punch right here. As he actually crits us, and I'm going for a knockoff. I know I'm. There we go. And ship face is about to go down. <laughs> so if we. Um, that was kind of a bad idea because I lost my switch in the Hound Doom. That was a really bad idea. Well, what's Steelix's? Speed. 30 40 
30. So we might be able to outspeed this thing and get off a drain punch. But if anyone, no one wants to come in, last voice is going to be a switch and duh. What about, what do we do plus two to last toys? Mock punch does 36%. Hello. We got a, was that a min roll? That was, oh no, that was a really big roll. All right, so now I'm going to go. Uh, and I lost my switch in the Houndoom. So I got to go eel. And I got to go for that Giga Drain, though. I mean, Virzion can come in easily, but first I think he would want to go into Steelix just to absorb the hit. Um, so, uh, yeah. So, yeah. What is up, everybody? I'm Griff from the Can Virgin Blaze Okay. So, yeah, we're just going to go for a Giga Drain no matter what. If Because I'm trying to catch the Steelix off guard. That's it. Flygon comes in. Still solid damage. Uh... Stop. I don't care. Alright, so I'm gonna go for a knockoff on his U turn, because, you know. Verizion's likely coming, that kind of sucks, and we're gonna give it a justified boost. But we know he has nothing to hit Girder, but Girder's dead. That kind of sucks, but. I don't care! As Verizion does come in, and now I gotta go for a flamethrower on his close. Mm, no. Um. All right, so ah, uh, close combat's gonna be coming our way, and I don't want to get close combated. But then he has Stone Edge, so I can't go into Flyguy City. I'm just gonna flamethrower, Leaf Blade, still takes us out. All right, but Tyler could come in, and uh, I think Super Power just kills it. So on the. Rizion, Sword Dance, Superpower, most likely kills. And his switch into that are limited. Blastoise is kind of weakened already, so doesn't really want to switch into it. <laughs> Alright, but yeah, so his Rizion is going to go down. Go down. Alright, so Blastoise does switch in, but you know, it takes a solid chunk, and I'm going into Fat Fish. I don't, I can't go into Fly Guy City until Houndoom's down. I don't really have, this doesn't need hazard control. Who gets hurt by Stealth Rocks? No one. Magic on, no damage from anything. Alright, so, this kind of sucks as he predicted that, so. I got his, I'm, I'm making the risky plan. I'm going to go into Tyrantrum as he SDs up, and we could just kill it. Because Fatfish is just set up bait, and I think he knows that. As Leaf Blade hurt. And I am literally clicking Superpower again. Blastoise is going to die if it comes in, right? No, it's not. So Blastoise is going to want to come in, but who cares? I'm still going to go for Superpower because I need this Verzion dead. As we actually get a crit, but that didn't matter because I could have easily just did that again. Steelix does come in, and I'm going to go into Fatfish right now. And he's going to go into Verzion, so I'm going to go... Uh, let me just see this. Stone Edge actually does not kill one shot, so I'm going to go into Fly Guy Siggy as he actually EQs here. And I'm going to double into... I lose my sturdy if I come back in. That kind of sucks. But, you know... This is not going well because I'm... He's obviously going to go into Houndoom. So I'm going to go into x -Elites. I mean, even if he heavy slams or stone edges, we absorb the hit with Steelix. And then we literally can click Earthquake. I mean, Flygon can come in, but what's Flygon going to do? I switched into Steelix. All right, so all right, so I go to Steelix as he goes into Flygon actually, and I'm just gonna heavy slam. Heavy slam should kill. 
Alright, so, on the fly gone. We don't know what this thing is yet. If it's a band, Heavy Slam does help. I see you turns out into another video. <laughs> and now we're just now we're just gonna earthquake. And I'm gonna go into Fly Guy Siggy, but he probably sees that coming, so I'm gonna go for another earthquake. Because it takes it out. Just kidding, my phone doesn't work. Alright, so yeah, he's probably thinking about his move, but I already thought about it. So yeah, someone, he could easily just go Flygon right here. He could easily just go Flygon. But you know, I'm not taking that risk. I'm staying in. Alright, so, um, yeah, just click, gonna click real quick, as it does take him out. Thank you, speed creeping works. The suggested spread is, like, something, and I just went one above that. Alright, so, I, um, he's gonna go for a fire blast. I hope you miss, so I can kill you. In that fire blast. But anyway, so, yeah. It should die, I think. <laughs> Go Gator Boy! Go Gator Boy! And he. Wait, I blame it on the reps. Shame. Alright, let me just count this out real quick. No, well, yes, but it's FF3. Mm -hmm. And who was I gonna do? I was doing Tyrant. Uh, so how much does an Outrage do to Houndoom? It's a guaranteed Oko. And what's his Verizion at? Hold up. His Verizion should die too, but I'm just gonna see. Uh, yeah. And we don't know what item his Flygon is. So yeah, that kind of sucks. But yeah, so we're just gonna go Tyler right now, and we're gonna do an Outrageous play right now, and just click Outrage. He probably does have Sucker Punch, but we'll find out. I don't really care, because this is my last chance to win at this point, Tyrantrum, because Fatfish, he, he's just going to set up nasty plots and win at that point, and Flyguy said you can't touch this thing. The best thing, it, the best thing it has for Houndoom is Energy Ball. So yeah, I don't know what he's going to do. I mean, he's making it seem like he doesn't have Sucker Punch, but, you know, he probably does. You are so dumb. Already dented a card today. Erect a wrist. Shut the fuck up. You don't fucking talk about that. Seriously, you don't fucking mention that again. Alright, so um, we know how he feels about that play. Hey, and we have. Oh, he's probably Scarf. Don't be Scarf. If it's Scarf, I don't outspeed it. Show me the quick attack. It is fine. I don't even get quick attack. Hey, it can get quick attack. But if you break. What? No, because I did dash. If I did this. Oh, he's Scarf. But you know, it's okay, because we got Fat Fish. Burn! Alright, now he's going to go Verzeon, so I got to go Fly Guy City. Because that's his best play. I mean, he can't cl keep clicking Outrage, but you know, I'm trying to win here. And if I let Fat... I mean, I can wish up, but... The um, thingy, the forms. Wait, how much does poison do? Is like twelve, right? Thirty-four plus twelve. 
We could live another one, so yeah. You know, I'm gonna wish and then switch into Fly Guy Siggy. No, I'm gonna go to Fly Guy Siggy right now. That because I've regenerated. Alright, so um, you know. You should go subscribe to the Brooklyn Blazekins. <laughs> Just kidding. I mean you probably should. After battle one, just to chill, guys. I'm trying to win, and I'll be happy. But you know, I have to go on a like a 20 game win streak. All right, so you know, we're just waiting for his move right now. If he hurts himself in his confusion, that's clutch. But he has to hurt himself in his confusion two times in a row if he stays in, unless he gets a crit if he hurts himself in his confusion. But anyway, battle timer's now on because I want to win. Should I just, if, if it goes down to like 270, I'm just going to pause it until he makes a move. Because he didn't even tell me he was leaving. Alright, so yeah. He has 270, so I'll pause it until he, he actually makes his move. Or we win. Or he made his move, so we're going to go. See? He <laughs> All right, so we're going to hope he misses his stone edge. Just kidding. We're going to double back. And we are going to click Scald. I mean, that's our best play. So, yeah. Can you guys chill? <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go into Fly Guy Siggy. I'm tightening you guys because you got. Eh! <laughs> Shut up, all falls down. I already lost anyway, so yeah. That's um, Battle 1, so now we're gonna wait for Battle 2. I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, now we are at Battle 2, and I'm finally by myself because those guys are idiots. So yeah, you too, man. Good luck. All right, so I'm gonna go lead Jolteon. I mean, yes, he does have two ground types, and Camerupt is a very likely lead. So you know what? You're right. I'm gonna lead Nemia, and if I have to, I'll U-turn out with another video. But yeah, so I'm just gonna upload and share real quick. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, we're waiting for his move as he goes and leads Flygon. Now, I don't know if he wants to risk the speed tie in case that is Scarf or Van too. So I'm actually going to go switch immediately into Almunia as he goes to that. And he has no grass type, so we're going to put someone. Sorry, you got to get more comfortable. We're putting someone to sleep, which is awesome. And who's going to be sleep fodder? You are, but you could easily wake up whenever so yeah um, I'm gonna go okay, hold up. I'm gonna do uh, Embor choice scarf superpower against um, scrap T probably dragon dance superpower is almost Oko so as she goes back into Flygon and now I do have two levitators so don't know what he's going to do about that. And I have Ice Beam on Mesprit. And, you know, he goes for an Outrage as he's Life Orb, actually. So, yeah, that kind of sucks. Mesprit has to go down. But he, since he's Life Orb, I could go into Jolteon and throw out the HP Ice. Since he's still stuck in Outrage, that Flygon is going to go down. Perfect. Pop. Kill you real quick. And now... Camerupt is likely to come out, so yeah, kind of sucks that I lost one of my Levitators. As he does go into Camerupt, but he might just go straight for a Fire Blast, as this is a very predictable play going into my other Levitator. But I don't know if that could be a, that's probably a Levitate Bronzong, but who knows, it could be Heatproof. We'll find out on this move. 
So yeah, we do go in Nemias. Yeah, he does go. He doesn't even mega evolve. So yeah, I'm going to go straight for the earthquake. It's a predictable play. It's the best play to do if he goes bronze on. I mean, never hurts the U-turn, but I just want to throw out as he does have levitate, and we are choice locked in. So Scrafty is asleep, and I'm gonna go into Pokeboo and throw out the Flare Blitz or the Wild Charge. Or should I, I'm gonna actually just go Jolteon real quick and throw out the Shadow Ball. As he goes straight for a Toxic, and I'm throwing out the Shadow Ball right now. I do want to keep Jolteon healthy, as it is one of the best checks to this thing that right here, the Hoopa. Shadow Ball does 55. Jeez, that's a lot. As he goes to Grafty, and, and not even going to risk him going into Camera Up, so I'm going to go straight. Ooh. Yeah, she shed skins right away. I'm gonna go into Almunia on the Dragon Dance. Camera up. Alright. I'm gonna put you to sleep real quick. Actually, no, he outspeeds. And that kinda sucks. I'm gonna go Flygon again. Let's go straight for Fire Blast. I'm gonna click U turn real quick on this thing. This goes Bronzong. That's some solid damage. And I'm going to go into Te. Almunia and Click Spore. I think it's the best play to do. If we lose this battle, remember, it's all over. So we go Scrafty again. I hate you, Scrafty. Shed's getting right away. Alright, so now you're asleep. Hopefully for one more turn as I switch out. And I think I'm actually going to click Flare Blitz as he goes camera up right here. Such an awkward position, but he's gonna go for the fire move as I'm gonna go for it straight for the superpower, and he actually goes for E power. And I'm actually gonna go trap him real quick, click earthquake, and now we're tied. Both of his ground types are now gone, so that is really helpful for Jolteon. Yeah, if I were him, I would go bronze on too. I don't know what else he could do, so let's just roll out the sucker punch. I mean, if we could kill this thing, that's cool. And it has to have, like, Earthquake or Zen Headbutt or something like that. Because he might predict the Amoongus to come in and go for a Zen Headbutt. Yes, Toxic, the 35 HP Pokemon. Alright, I'm going to go Flygon right here, as he might switch out into someone. And I'm going to click whatever I need to. So yeah, that's cool. Hey, how low Jolteon is. I really wanted to use um, that Mesprit to Healing Wish it back up. I usually Healing Wish either Jolteon or Embor because they're the ones that usually get worn down the fastest because of Life Orb and Reckless, but that's cool, that's cool. Whoa, how much HP is Fly on Oh yeah, Fire Blast. Camerupt is just so powerful. As I'm actually going to pressure him with the timer, you know, that was 300 seconds. I'll pause until he makes a move. Alright, he actually makes his move, so let's see what he does. This goes Blastoise. Now I'm going to click U-turn into Almunia. And is anybody asleep right now? It's Crafty, right? Yeah. Kind of sucks we lost our check to it. He probably knows that we're going to click U-turn, but someone's taking serious, and I mean serious damage from this. Because look at this, Blastoise, yeah, it's going to take, it's banded U-turn, so, from 448 attack, it's crazy. Bronzong is probably going to die, Scrafty's going to take some damage, Hoopa, yes, it resist. no, it doesn't even resist, so Hoopa might even die from this. Hold up, let's see. Probably not. Trick room with max speed, whatever. And, uh, Flygon. Choice band, you turn almost <laughs> this so much. But he stays in, we take we do 20%. I'm gonna go into Almunia. And who is this switching on to this? Now I'm just gonna click Giga Drain on Hoopa. Oh no. Who do I not need? I probably don't need you, so just kill me real quick. Go into Dougie, you're dead. Right, hold up. Can psychics escape from? Oh, ghost, 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 ghost. 
I'm gonna go into you, click Volt Switch. It looks like we lost this one too because this team is, I, I mean, I made it, but it's not finished. It's just, it's won me some games. I mean, we're, all, we're only down, hold up, how weak is? Hoopa is 69, 83, about halfway, and 86. I mean, we're not totally out of it. We're, our team is just really, really weakened right now. This is freaking rocks. I didn't get my rocks up because of that life warp flygon. I did not see a life warp flygon like that happen but you know it's whatever it's whatever it's whatever so yeah I'm not giving up yet does go for a tarot ball now and that is game that is pretty much game right there I'm gonna go for a u-turn but you know as he goes for a gyro ball right here and I have to click Outrage. If we get a crit, you know. GG. Ah, uh, well, that's unfortunate. I did play it a little risky, and it did not pay off. Ah, oh, man, that's really unfortunate. It's because of my stupid friends. I'm blaming them. We did have a pretty good team, not gonna lie, but yeah, that's it. So... I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay fly, you know, all that stuff.